When you like the people you work with, when you like your clients, and you, you like coming to work, you're gonna do better work, and the clients are happy, and everybody's happy. David Zapata, I'm the founder of and CEO of Zapwater Communications. We are an integrated communications firm based here in Chicago, but with offices in Miami and LA. Uh, and we specialize in lifestyle brands and, and travel. When I started the agency, I was really focused on how do I build a travel practice? And people told me that I couldn't do it out of Chicago. You know, you gotta be in New York or you gotta be in LA. Um, and we, we just, you know, listened and, and, and learned from other agencies. Um, and, I, and, you know, the one true um, professional mentor I ever had was a, a woman named Judy McCluskey who ran a travel agency in London. And, you know, she's passed away since. But, you know, she told me, you know, just focus on it, get that first client, and they'll follow you. And sure enough, you know, our first client was, was the Maldives. Um, we flew and met them and, and sold them on an idea, uh, almost cold. And, you know, we've been with them, you know, on and off for almost six years now um, through two governments. Since then, we, we now work with Finland and, and, you know, Portugal and Panama and uh, Grenada and, and different regions of Mexico. So it was really, you know, the advice is follow your passion and, you know, you'll do really good work and, and the rest will follow. You know, like any entrepreneur, the, the biggest obstacle for us has always been scaling and scaling, res you know, responsibly. Um, you know, we've averaged, you know, 20, 25 percent growth a year over the last couple of years, and and that has included some micro acquisitions, uh, buying other small agencies. Um, so it's been managing that growth respectfully. You know, managing our cash flow, which is a challenge for any any business. Um, but then also integrating cultures of, of two new agencies in, into Zapwater. I always say there's no sacred cows when we bring on new people. And, and you know, it's, everybody has to be willing to learn from each other. Uh, what works, works, and, and you know, what doesn't, doesn't. And you know, at the end of the day, you, you integrate the cultures and, and really uh, get a best of breed product. You know, I always say, uh, you know, you spend more time with the people you work with than the, than the people you love. Um, you know, I travel with people from our office. Um, I see them more than I see my wife and kids sometimes. So the first and most important thing is you have to like the people you work with. You know, it starts there and then it's, it's respect, it's, it's understanding that people are making sacrifices for the greater good of the company. So it's, it's really building a culture that understands that and, and invests in them and, you know, goes above and beyond with things like flexibility and benefits and it, and it's worked. I mean, I think there's a reason we've been named, you know, one of the best agencies to work for every year since 2011. Um, it's all about the culture. And, and again, when you like the people you work with, when you like your clients and you, you like coming to work, you're going to do better work and the clients are happy and everybody's happy.